Today is another beautiful day in Togo, West Africa, and we are cooking a delicious healthy food with grandma. I remember back in the days, our grannies never liked our food, but they decided to cook by allowing us to put the ingredients in the pot to make us think we cooked the food. Today, grandma is doing exactly that by teaching us to cook scent leaves and melon seed soup. Hope you love this video. Hope you enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Let's get it started. Bravo, Tatiana! As you can see, I am still in Togo, and guess what? I just found myself in one of our famous footballer in Ghana, Mohamed Polo. I don't know if you, you know him. This is Mohamed Polo. This is his family house, okay? He grew up from this place, and this place is where his grandfather was living. So this is where Mohamed Polo in Ghana was living. I don't know if they still have some connections here, but his cousin was the man who came to pick me from that station so come with us let's go and cook food at Mohammed Polo's Odin Day's house yeah. mm. okay. hey, that's okay. Can I get yeah, this is uh, scent leaf uh, we are going to do a soup called scent leaf soup how do you no, um, how do you call it locally this soup a soup okay so we are going to grind this uh scent leaves okay so this one is called what kulozo mm. kulozori in their mm. language what language is that mm -hmm. kokoli kotokoli mm. ah okay mm. so we are pounding the egusi mm. we are pounding the egusi that's melon seeds esuru okay esuru esuru I'm falling. So we are going to pound it. Oh. So when the no, the kid does something, yeah, 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 the kid does something. Yeah, blah. Yeah. So this is our meat for our soup. Hey, I'm looking, I'm looking good. Yeah, I'm a liar. <laughs> So guys, we are going to start. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We call it, they call it, we tau. Okay, the Amalia is called we tau. We tau si Okay, yo, oh yo. We are going to add some mm. of this one. Look at it. So we have some mackerel in, in it. And they have steamed it up. They have steamed it up. A little bit so you can see it has been cooked a little bit. What did you use to cook this? Okay, we saw the spice like ginger, mm -hmm. uh, ca um, garlic, and onion. Okay, so should I add some? Mm -hmm. Should I pour? Is it okay? Hello? Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. I should, I should, I should add more. Mm -hmm. Eh, mm -hmm. Should I add the onion? Eh, do the I do Everything or there is okay. It's okay. Okay. I should add. So we are all, we are adding in pepper. Is it okay? I should add. It's okay. Okay. So we added, we added in onion and pepper with the palm oil okay uh -huh. do i have to mm. stir it mm. won't it break down everything mm. okay so we are pouring it in the what is the name a goosey melon seeds mm -hmm. 
Egusi. Ah, Gusi. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. So we wash it up with a little bit of water like this. I should pour it all in. Okay. All right. I should stay. So right now, we are cooking. I'm cooking with my grandmother. One of the Akutukuli food from the north. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, scent leaves that we are going to use for our uh, goosey soup. This one, okay. Uh -huh. So we have this on the, on the fire, mm -hmm. and we have already pounded some yeah. of the scent mm -hmm. leaves. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so later we pour it in. Uh, so say no, we are going to mix it, stir it up. Mm. I think there, there are meats too in it. Yes, we have meats too in it. So you just, you don't have just the salmon, we have meats too. And you see it, here it is. Uh -huh. We are going to add in our vegetable stock um, cube. Like stock. this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The fish, I should divide it. Mm. Did it? Half. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm dividing it and then add it mm -hmm. in. Okay. This is so healthy, guys. This is so healthy. Wow. This is why these Nordinas, they, they go very, they age so well. I come on you check. And then I'm saying, I have a I should add it in. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So we are going to add in our scent leaves, okay? So she was saying that this one is very medicinal. Ask her what can it cure? Like what's okay. So right now it's boiling again. So we are going to put in the scent leaves, okay? This is the scent leaves. We 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 pounded it. Okay, like this. So I was told grandma was trying to say that this is very medicinal because it helps pregnant women. And let's say women who has already given mm -hmm. birth, okay? It helps them after birth. When you eat this one in the, from where they come from, when you eat this one, it helps um, flush out the blood in your system. When, when you have your menstrual cycle, this helps it flow out of your system very easily. And it also helps with um, stomach pains and um, what again? stomach pains and when a lady has infection it also helps with it and when you eat it more of the time it helps with the blood system and circulation it's very healthy because these grandmothers have been eating this kind of food for a very long time so, so so we are going to add in salt okay yeah, grandma is going to give me sauce. So this is how our soup looks like. It smells really good. It smells really good. I want to try it, okay, for salt. Hmm. So grandma is an expert in this cooking. So because grandma started her soup by boiling the meat and the mackerel before starting everything she added in salt and and stock and uh, some spices okay so whilst we were doing our food she hasn't added in any salt because of what she added in um, the, in the meat okay so that it will mix together and then leave we shouldn't be adding in too much salt and then it will be too much of us to eat so when you are tasting it or when you are eating it and you feel you want more salt you add in the salt then you are good to go but when i tasted it i feel the salt is okay so now this is the akumes
So guys, our food is ready. We have our akpale with our um, what's the name? Scent leaf soup with oh, agushi esro. Okay. Eh, Grandma, mm -hmm. thank you for this food. Oh, akpale. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But we are going to try it. So how do I eat it? I should just dip it. Eh, uh huh. You just dip it in. Mm -hmm. Like this. It is good. It's better than the one we tried the other day. Mm. Mm. It's because they planted mm -hmm. that and they, it's like they added a ginger. Ginger, too much ginger. Mm. I like this. It's, it tastes good. You can feel the egushi, the melon seed. You can also taste the. You can feel the melon. You can taste the melon seed. You can taste the meat too. It's very good. Like it has really balanced. And if you notice, we didn't add too much salt because she used it to steam it up at the beginning. Mmm. It tastes good. Then. How do you say it? It's okay. It just tastes like um, boma. Boma. It like boma. Okay. But mm. it's because they use the scent leaf. Oh. They don't use the boma. Okay. Wow, it is good. Oh, so good. So good. <laughs> so delicious. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video. Hope to see you in our next episode, okay? Until next time, ciao, ciao. <laughs>